What makes the Earth spin on its axis every day? To answer this tricky question, we have to look back in time to when the Earth was born, 4.5 billion years ago. We have to ask, why did the Earth start spinning in the first place? When our solar system formed out of a gas cloud, called a nebula, there was lots of dust and gas coming together due to the force of gravity. The dust and gas was already moving around in a circle. As it all clumped together to form the Sun and planets, these new objects started to spin, and then spin faster. So when all of the rocks in the clump of dust and gas started coming together, that made the Earth's spin speed up. We've covered what made the Earth start spinning, and what made it pick up speed. But why does it keep spinning? In theory, a spinning object will just keep spinning forever unless you add energy or take it away. There's not much friction in a fidget spinner toy. That's why they can spin for so long. Now imagine the Earth floating in space. It will keep spinning unless something slows it down. It would take a lot of energy to slow down the spinning Earth because it is so big. It's not spinning on the ground, so the ground won't slow it down. There's no air outside our own atmosphere to slow it down either. That is why the Earth has continued to spin for a very long time. However, some things are slowing the Earth down or could change its spinning in the future. You might have heard that the moon causes the waves and tides in our oceans. Because of this, the Earth is slowing down very slowly, about one second every 50,000 years. As a result, the moon is also slowly moving away from us. When the Earth and moon were very new, the moon was much closer. In fact it is thought that the moon was once part of Earth but they came apart during an explosive collision with a huge asteroid. How do we know that? Well, scientists examining rocks realized that there used to be many more days in a year. In the age of the dinosaurs, a day was 22 hours rather than 24 hours that it is today. The sun's gravitation also causes the Earth to slow down a bit too. And if an asteroid or comet hit the Earth, that might speed us up, slow us down or even knock us over. Cool Planet Spinning Fact All the planets have different day lengths. These different day lengths are because of how the planets were formed and what knocked into them when they were very young. 